video I am going to show you how I made my e-bike and how you can make your own. So this one is a throttle activated e-bike which means you can manually pedal it and switch it to the electric motor when you want. So for full charge it takes nearly 3 to 4 hours and goes up to 6 km electric only. Gives a maximum speed of 25 km per hour, minimum speed 10 km per hour and it will cost you nearly 11,000 rupees. Only the components and the race depends on which cycle you use. So first I will show you the components you need, then I will show you how to fix the components and make the connection. All these components are easily available online in eBay or Amazon. So this one is a 24 volt motor, 250 watt. Its cost is nearly 4,799 rupees, and it can lift a maximum weight of 60 to 65 kg. Its speed controller, uh, which should also be 24 volt, 250 watt, and its cost is 1,259 rupees. An e-bike throttle, and its cost is 499 rupees. Two batteries, both 12 volt, and its cost is 1,190. A battery charger and its cost is 2,529 rupees. A box, I have used an old electric main switch box. A plate to fix the motor uh, and a chain and a switch. Let's show you how to connect the speed controller. Here you need to connect the batteries. Uh, red wire is positive, black wire is negative. Here you need to connect the motor. The positive one is blue, negative one white. In some speed controller, the negative one may be yellow but the positive one will always be blue. Here you need to connect the throttle. This one is for the switch. And this one charging port. I drill here three holes to fix the box and the motor. I've already fixed the fuel by giving three to four spots of welding. Let's fix the components.
At last I want to say that you can increase the range of the C bike by connecting two more batteries with these two in parallel or you can use lithium ion batteries which are more environment friendly and have longer battery life than these leadership batteries. Thanks for watching the video.